back to my channel i am blessing career and this is bk says we're talking about headphones and the headphones i'm totally obsessed with right now is the behringer hc 2000 bnc with active noise cancelling and wireless features i love it i use it at my friend's office and i absolutely love the fact that it cancelled out all the background noise and i said oh, you know what I'm gonna get one for myself. So we're going to unbox this right now and I'll tell you reasons why I love this apart from the fact that it's super lightweight, detachable cables. Uh, did I talk about the active noise cancellation? It's crisp, trust me. It, it went from to absolute silence. So without further ado, let's do this. Hi guys, so uh, we are going to be unboxing the HC BNC wireless active noise cancelling headphone with Bluetooth connectivity. And well, pretty straightforward pack. This is from Beringa. Uh, pardon the tears on it, I ordered it from Lagos and I live in northern Nigeria, so it's quite a journey getting it here and well, life happened to it on the way. So, let's get right into it. What's falling from this? Uh, the manual, start a quick guide in English. Not the entire manual is in English. If you need translations, I don't know, maybe check the website. This are connecting cables. These are the aux cables. And this is the aux cable. Ready? How did this wire is really be doing these things? Uh, it's about half a meter. 3.5 mm to 3.5 mm. The charging cable is USB A to the micro USB port. So be sure to take note of that in case you're traveling or whatever. The cable is still pretty much the same. 0.5 meters, well 0.5 meters folded into half. This is what it looks like. And now our main interest, the bearing the HC2000 BNC. It has the adjustable head feature. As I mentioned earlier, I had used this in my colleague's office and I really thought it was a cool headphone to have for traveling because I travel quite a lot and it also lets you have the wireless feature. This is 3.5 mm jack, indicators, the ANC. So, I mean, this is like the transformers of headphones because it goes, it folds in like I'm sure that's not supposed to happen. So it goes in this way. It could stay this way. It could just be face up. It could, and when it's face up, this goes down and then showcasing the brand name. Uh, anyways, let's get to the ports. This is the active noise cancelling and it doubles as the power button. Uh, this indicator is to show when the active noise cancelling is on, this LED light goes on. Uh, this is the rewind. This is pause or play. This is fast forward or skip button. So all these three. Uh, the buttons are pretty small, but my hands are tiny, so... Well, I don't have any trouble pressing the buttons, but if your hands are bigger, maybe it's going to be a problem for you. This little point here is the microphone for phone calls and voice commands. This is the aux in jack, the auxiliary cable goes in here. Uh, 3.5 mm stereo connectors as well can be used here. And the indicator LED light blinks when in use or when it's charging or when the power is on. This is the micro USB port for charging. Uh, this is the LED light indicator. I like how light it feels in my hands and the fact that it could just fold without getting destroyed. Yeah, that's a plus. I'm not really sure that's supposed to happen. So yeah, pretty dope to me. Uh, this feels very soft. The leather feels like it's going to last a while, uh, although it's very light, but it still feels Kind of wholesome. Uh, you also can, the ANC button also powers the active noise cancelling. So 
you could activate active noise cancelling after powering turn by just long pressing this when you go over the manual you could see all the other features or how you can use them for varying circumstances so hc 2000 bnc bnc because it has bluetooth connection uh the 2000 without bnc does not have that according to the product features on their website the hc 2000 bnc is suitable for mixing and recording monitoring a baseline or just sitting back to enjoy your favorite song I tested it for all the circumstances and I did enjoy listening to my favorite song on it. One con I would say that stood out for me regarding the HC 2000 BNC is the fact that it wasn't so good for mixing a recording or monitoring a recording. As a voice artist, I tried using this to monitor my recording and also play back my recording while editing and I found it very unpleasant because I missed out on little details that I normally would pick up on as the sound was very colored and I was unable to pick up on like the clicks or um, the true tone of my voice and the little nuances I normally would with a very mixing tailored headphone and I feel this is very important. So if you're just going to enjoy your favorite music or play back instrumentals or just like block out the noise, the flight noise or casual noise or going for a run or workout as you saw in the intro, that's totally fine. This is a case for the AirPod Pro Max, but because it has the same build as the Behringer um, HC 2000 BNC, I decided to get it because as we say in Nigeria, it better me this safe than to this sorry. So it's better you're safe than sorry that, oops, I didn't buy a case and then my headphone is ruined. So yeah, that is why we have this. Voila! I like the fur feel in it. I got this for about $15 on AliExpress and uh, deliver us pretty fast let me know if you would want the direct link to purchase this or add it in the comment section so let's just uh, put this okay you see pretty solid eh? waterproof Hard case. Sounds like a good bargain to me. I hope you're convinced now that you should get yourself a Beringer HC 2000 BNC because I mean it's portable, it's affordable, it's sleek, it's lightweight, and I said so. <laughs> I hope you come your way again next time. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on post notifications till I bring you another unboxing video or another talk, lifestyle, travel, voiceover oriented video. I'm a polymath, I know. Turn on post notifications. Bye.